All right, welcome back YouTube. And today I want to just give y'all a quick little video and let's talk about how I was able to get a $400 hotel room for absolutely free from American Express with use of one of their cards. Okay, so as you all know, um, I have been involved in utilizing credit cards now for about two years in the respects of using them to gain rewards and utilize those rewards to get things for free and be able to travel and get hotel stays and uh, get cash back and other rewards from these cards for absolutely free. Um, I love being able to do it. I love using my credit cards and being able to see if I spend in this category or if I buy these particular items, how much money I'm able to save and how many different things I'm able to do and accomplish by having that credit available to me as well as by having the opportunity to utilize these different credit card rewards programs and get different things. So um, sometime last year, I went ahead and applied for the um, Hilton card from American Express. So we got the Hilton card. We chose to get the business version of the card um, because it had a good sign up bonus. Um, we could use it with what we do as well as we were thinking about doing some traveling for the YouTube channel and thought, hey, what better card to get than a card that's going to get us some hotel points because we already had the cards that would allow for us to get the uh, Delta miles as well as we had the American Express charge cards, which would get us the MR points. So it was like, okay, what better card to add to this lineup at this point than to get a card that's going to offer us something for hotels because we can get flights um, as well as rental cars or anything else like that that we may need for free utilizing those other cashback cards or the MR points or the Delta Sky Miles. So, hey, let's go ahead and get this Hilton card. Well, we ended up having a few things pop up within the last year, um, you know, with expecting a child as well as uh, having the children that we recently added um, to our family. And so... And having all those different things pop up, travel has been a lot um, more difficult to try to figure out and having to manage and balance so many different things and preparation. Um, it just really made us say, OK, we're going to kind of dial back from travel until we get some things figured out uh, legally, as well as getting some things figured out in the respects of um, having, you know, appropriate child care and things like that, and being able to just, you know, move freely and do what we need to do for the children. So we ended up um, deciding that we would spend our hotel points later on, and we would just keep the card active and keep utilizing it to gain more points, um, just as well as in the event that we do have an event, we will just book our hotel off of those points so this past weekend uh we had our baby shower and in having our baby shower um we had a great turnout it was a, a lovely event with having all of our family there and just being able to spend time and really prepare and kick back and relax but because we did it um further down south where we both pretty much grew up and went to school we decided that we were going to get a hotel. So now in this process, we went and looked on the hotel portal. There were actually no hotels that for a cash um, value with the Hilton were less than $250 per night. So we ended up deciding, hey, let's go ahead, use these points and get us a hotel room because it doesn't really make sense to spend $250 um, on a hotel room 
and it just be a basic hotel room, not a luxury hotel room or anything like that. So we went to the portal. We found a luxury hotel room, um, in a four star uh, Hilton um, resort, and we ended up booking that hotel room. We booked it just a couple nights before the um, event, which also probably made the high the price a little bit higher. Uh, however. This hotel room, instead of us paying the $400 per night that we would have paid for booking the hotel room, we ended up spending about 40,000 Hilton points per night. So this is something that I always try to get everyone to understand. So we basically opened up a credit card. We opened this credit card up. We ended up getting the card when the annual fee for the card was a hundred dollars we met the minimum spend requirement and we've gotten probably about two three thousand dollars worth of hotel points just off of utilizing them correctly and at the right times from using this card so why not open up a card meet those minimum spend requirements with your normal spending habits and then take those points and utilize them to go on trips, go on vacation. Use them when you have family events. Use them when you just want a day to relax or something else to do. And enjoy yourself every step of the way. So with that being said, I just wanted to kind of give you guys my insight on what we were able to do and share with you guys what you all have the potential to do if you continue on your credit journey and how you will be able to still live in style and enjoy your life, but for a lot cheaper or potentially even free. That being said, as always, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for tuning in and we'll see you in the next one.